Hi, I'm Gary, and this is my wife, Regina. We're from Regina's Quilting Studio, the ones who created the leader grips, the first in the original leader grip system of rod and clamp system for loading the long arm. What we do is we start out by putting a dowel rod in the end of the leaders. A lot of the leaders already have a casing. If not, you may have to sew a three quarter inch casing on the leaders you have. But we're gonna put a dowel rod in there. I don't have a dowel rod, it's eight or 10 foot long, so I wanna join them together. We join them together with a little piece of electrical heat shrink. Looks like that when you get it in our kit, slides over the dowel rod where the joint is, heat it up with a hot air gun, it shrinks down, holds it, lets it be flexible, but it holds it together. Once we've installed that in the, in the leader, it's in there forever and ever. We don't need to worry about it again. It's a one-time application. So we're ready to load a quilt. We start out by with the center of the fabric and the center of the leader, same as if you were pinning it on. We put a mini grip there. We'll come down to the end and put a mini grip. And we'll put a mini grip at the other end. Then we're ready for the longer grips. It's a two-hand process. The hand that's out further, I'm gonna steady the dowel rod. With the hand near the center, we're gonna squeeze, roller and all. And just like a Ziploc bag, we're gonna work our way down, whether I'm squeezing with my thumb or fingers. We get to the little guy, we'll slide him out of the way, but I'll still hold on to the dowel to the very, very end. We'll switch to the other side. I switch hands because this hand's further out, this one's close. This one's gonna do the pinching and we take Again, just like that Ziploc bag, we work our way down, quick and easy. When I get that little guy, slide him out of the way. Now we can pull our tension up. We can put good tension on our quilt. We can look down along the side and see that we have nice straight fabric, so we know we're straight and square. It's also clear plastic, so if it was up under, we'd know how far up it is, know whether it's getting a good grip or not. We also have our side grip. The machines usually come with a couple of these grips and they sometimes pull at the fabric a little bit. This is our side grip. The rod's a little longer for a reason. We try to line up one edge. When we snap it on, it goes on the same basic way. Then we can hook our regular clamp onto the ribbon. We get nicer tension on our fabric and more importantly, the bottom plate of your machine can go by without hitting the clamp. So now we can sew up closer to that edge without that bottom plate being an issue. If you notice, we have a 10 inch clamp on an 18 inch opening. We don't need to go wall to wall to get nice tension. Also, I mentioned the rod was a little longer. I need something to hold on to whenever I go to take that off. We have these in four sizes. We make a six, a 10, a 14, and an 18. They sell for $15 a pair, no matter the size. And on our main leader grip system, if you do all three leaders, we have kits from eight foot up to 12 foot, depending on how long your leaders are, they sell for $89. And when you're all done, it's time to take the quilt off the frame. All you have to do is pull them off. No pins, no blood, no DNA left behind. Thanks for watching. Look for us at the leader grip booth at the next AQS Quilt Week.